Welcome. In this video, I will be discussing how attendance will be taken in a virtual environment. The way we take attendance and the definition of attendance has changed now that we're in an alternative setting. The School District of DeSoto County is legally required to take attendance. However, we want to stress to parents and students that our primary concern is the completion of assignments, not the time of day or the amount of time students take to complete these assignments. So you may be asking how we are going to take attendance. In a virtual environment, attendance is taken very differently than in a live classroom setting. Because we understand that your child may access the virtual courses at various times throughout the day, teachers will not be taking attendance for a given school day until the following school day to account for student participation in the evening hours and or over the weekend. Attendance information will be gathered differently based upon the course in which your child is enrolled. For students with courses in Schoology, there's an attendance survey that needs to be completed every day. When they log into Schoology and select the course, there will be an attendance link within the course. Your child just needs to click on the link and enter their name. If your child has multiple courses in Schoology, this process will have to be completed daily for every course. If your student has a course on Apex, Apex tracks login information as well as time on tasks. Students taking an APEX course do not need to complete a survey for the teacher to record attendance. We will be able to see what your child is doing virtually. For students that do not have a Schoology or APEX course, the teachers will be utilizing the completion of assignments to mark attendance. These requirements will vary depending on course. Courses that may not have a Schoology or APEX component are ages 3 to 5 exceptional student education courses and many of the exceptional student education full-time classrooms. Please be advised that when parents and students log into Skyward, attendance information will no longer be available. Currently, we are utilizing attendance information to gauge participation. Attendance itself will not negatively impact your child. As previously mentioned, the most important thing is that the child completes the work. When a student logs into the system, and for how long, is not as important as the completion of assignments. We understand that the time a student takes to complete a task will vary from student to student. Final grades will be based upon the completion of work. The School District of DeSoto County understands that some parents and students may currently have accessibility issues to online coursework. The inability to access coursework will not negatively impact your child as long as when access is obtained, the coursework is completed. For students that do not have access to the internet in their homes, the following are some ways to gain access. Hotspots. We are asking that parents and students try to use hotspots on their phones to access content. Many cellular providers have currently lifted restrictions. If you do not have a phone with a hotspot, please be advised that many internet service providers are offering free internet options. Information about these companies is provided in the link in the description. The School District of DeSoto County is working to provide alternative solutions for students that do not have internet access. Additional information pertaining to these solutions is forthcoming. Please visit the link in the description for more information. The School District of DeSoto County realizes that this is a new process for everyone, even for us. We're continuously collaborating to ensure that we do address issues that may be arising from parents and students. I have provided a link in the description that will provide you with the resources and information discussed in this video. Do not forget that we're available to assist you with any questions you may have. For technical support, please call the numbers on your screen or email techsupport at desotoschools.com. Thank you.